Hi everyone, today we're back landscaping. I'm at the shop early on this Monday morning. Today's a busy one guys, we're gonna be doing multiple jobs here. I have several employees getting all the equipment ready, but today I'm gonna spend about a half a day here mowing an overgrown property with a motorhome on it. And it's gonna be a fun one here for us. So guys, we're gonna be taking the Ram 3500 with a deck over wheels trailer. Now one of the skid steers is going out on a job here, but I'm thinking guys that I want to use a new K skid steer, the TV370. So let's hop in this, we'll get switched over here to the brush mower and we'll get on over to a job here. I always like to get going as early as we can, especially on a Monday morning. Yeah, that way we could get uh, to work and uh, start to make some money. Like always guys, there's a full mods list link down below. And if you end up enjoying today's video, help me out by hitting the like button. This will be our first job getting to use the new case here, which is super exciting. We recently just picked this up. I did load one of the dump trucks here in the yard with uh, dirt, and I really did like it. And we'll have to see how it does here, especially my own brush with a high RPM for uh, most of it here. That's going to be put to work here, but I'm going to get this thing strapped down, uh, put the directions in the GPS here, and we'll get on our way to the job. All the crews have left the shop just before 7 a.m. That's awesome. No one called out. Everybody was on time, which is great to see. We're actually only about five to six minutes away from today's job here. It's quite a, a short drive here for us. And after this one, I actually have to go help out on another job here with the case. And uh, it's just going to be a busy day here for us. The season is really picking up with jobs. I've been busy all weekend giving quotes. And we're just going to keep on going like this. And later on this week, uh, Bob is going to be joining us once again for a project. And we're pulling up to today's uh, job here since we are on a little bit of a busy county road here. We'll get the strobe lights, get the beacon lights going here for us. That way they slow down a little bit as they come to our truck and trailer here. But you guys can see this is the property. I mean, look at how tall this is, guys. I don't think I've seen grass this tall in quite a few years here. Definitely in Farm Sim, this is the tallest grass we do have here. Looks like the county did mow right along the roadway on both sides here on the corner. But other than that, uh, hopefully there's no critters or anything running around. So we'll get the case warmed up here. We're going to get right to work here, get in this property mode, get in this overgrown property back, looking cleaned up, and it should only take a few hours. Let's get the blades fired on up here. I'm always uh, excited to get to mowing on a Monday here. Now, like I did mention, guys, we actually have one crew going out today to do some weekly lawn care, so we're still keeping up with all those accounts, and I'm uh, here doing this project, and if I'm not going to do a skid steer job after this, I think I might meet up with that crew here, but wow, guys, this is going to be a challenge for sure here. We're going to have to go nice and slow. We do not want to bog down the skid steer here. Uh, we're at almost 4 RPM. I mean, just look at how tall this grass is. Wow. Like I mentioned, guys, I think that this is a first for seeing a grass this tall uh, here in farms and before. But it's so cool uh, to be able to put the new machine to work here. I've been uh, giving so many quotes. And a lot of the times, guys, uh, all the jobs require skid steers here. These are just so handy, so versatile. And it's just awesome to have a fleet of skid steers uh, since they're the main machines we really use. This property looks to be just about half an acre here, so it's not too, too big. We've done a lot bigger brush clearing and overgrown grass mown before, but wow, this is definitely going to be pretty tricky here. I'm almost thinking we'll have to look and see how uh, the uh, brush cutter does, and uh, we might have to make a second pass over this because this is really heavy. You guys can see it's pretty dense in almost most of the areas here. It looks like there's some other weeds here, but wow. I think this might also make some really good hay.
So far, it's been a pretty busy uh, spring here for the business. We are just doing job after job, and it's been a lot of fun here so far. And we definitely have already expanded the business here uh, just within the first month or so of uh, being back to work here. But you guys can see it almost looks like that the more I'm looking at it, I think only one pass is what we need here. I did go a little bit slower than what I usually do, so that really helped uh, kind of get the uh, grass clippings really cut and really uh, not having too much clumping. Now there does seem to be some different things here at this property. Some older sheds, some old spare tires or something like that here. So I will recommend to the landowner uh, to see if they want us to come back and clean those up for a fee here. But there we have it guys. We just brush mowed this entire property here. This is actually going to go under redevelopment. And they wanted us to do the brush mowing uh, so that they could get the survey crews out here to survey the land and to start to prep for uh, building a new house here, which definitely should be a lot of fun. I think that builder is going to give us the contract for all the dirt work and even the excavation of the foundation, which is pretty cool. And he, and he was just having us out here, like I was mentioning, uh, the survey crews definitely don't want to be walking in. Uh, two and a half to three foot tall grass. So we got this cleaned up ready for them uh, to get to work there and back up on this trailer. Wow, this Diamond Sea trailer, guys, is becoming one of my favorites here in Farm Sim. It is just so versatile with the different machines we can haul here with it. But I'm going to get this skid here dropped off back at the shop and I'm going to go mow uh, with the crew mowing some residential lawns here. So until next time, guys, thanks for watching. Stay tuned for next one and subscribe for more.